Hello, Aloy. Is there more you wish to talk about? There is, Cyan. All right, Cyan. I'm going to leave you for now. I will quite literally always be available, Aloy. Chieftain. Just... Aloy. As you wish. I wondered if you thought... that if I'd never come along, Araya might still... If you'd never come along, I would have marched my kin to our deaths. Araya would be alone, and the spirit she sacrificed so much for would be lost. Either way, I would not have been able to protect her. You didn't let her down. You helped her do what she wanted. To find her destiny. If that's destiny, I wouldn't wish it on anyone. That's fair. But she was ready to face it. Only in the struggle against death do we find even for a moment the spark of life. Truly, Araya found the spark. I'm proud of her. Though I grieve for her passing, at last I truly know who she was, and why the spirit was so important. For so long she told me, if only you could have heard it, brother. Now I understand. There's something else, isn't there? I can't stay here, Aratok. And where I'm going, the Warak can't follow. Besides, it already had a chieftain before me. A strong one, I think. A wiser one, for the path we shared. The daemon is gone, but there's much to be done. You mean the new units that Cyan said escaped the cauldron? Yes, fire claws. Now Tuke has been tracking them from Song's Edge. I could help with those. I have no doubt. You're practically Banuke. It would seem your time among the Banuke wasn't a waste after all. Firebrick, Cyan, Hephaestus. All very interesting. So, the signal that woke Hades woke Hephaestus too. And unleashed them on the world. His minds on their own. So it seems. Parts of Gaia given life. Apparent life. Transformed from docile subordinate functions into rebellious intelligences beyond our understanding. Our current understanding, anyway. Whatever they are, they're still out there. And they both want you dead. Kind of mutual, that feeling. We haven't seen the last of Hephaestus, I'm certain of that. It's powerful, creative, and driven. It won't stop building new hunter killers, which means that someday we may have to stop it. We? Or whoever gets there first. Hephaestus wasn't the only thing I learned about in the cut silence. Heard some things about the Banuke Conclave, too. You could stop right there. Is that what you told the hunters the Banuke sent after you? Before you opened fire? Oh no, Aloy. Only to you do I extend the courtesy of a warning. My past and my secrets are my own. You'd do well to remember that. It's a good thing you've got brain silence, because your personality could use some work. This discussion is concluded. I think it was over before it began. Catch up with your down the trail. 